So what's happened is that through the implementation of the Federal Reserve System, the government has become uh, invested in these bankers, and they get their money from the bankers. And so they may impose a tax on us, which makes us more slaves, makes it more difficult for us to survive, right? Giving them more profits. And now what's happened is that uh, through the, the, the Federal Reserve System, the bankers, have pretty much taken control of our government. It doesn't matter Republican and Democrat anymore, because they're both the same. Neither one of them are talking about shutting down the Federal Reserve System or stopping the payment of taxes, you know, uh, or any of the big issues that face Americans, right? So uh, I had a friend, Nick Rockefeller, okay, who's one of the Rockefeller family, and he, uh, uh, when I was running for governor in Nevada, he came to me, introduced himself to me through an attorney, and uh, we became friends and started talking about things. And um, I learned an awful lot from Mr. Rockefeller. And one of the things that we used to talk about was the ultimate plan of the banking industry, what they wanted to accomplish. And the goals of the uh, banking industry, not, not just the Federal Reserve System, but the private banks in Germany and England, all over Italy, all over the world, they all work together. They're all central banks. And they're, and they're all part of the Communist Manifesto. You know, central banking is one of the major planks of the Communist Manifesto. We talk about America being a capitalistic country, but yet at the same time we have a central bank that plans everything for us, right? And the graduated income tax is another plank of the Communist Manifesto, right? So right there you have two major planks of the Communist Manifesto that have been brought in because of the Federal Reserve System, okay? So uh, the ultimate goal that these people have in mind is the goal to um, create a one world government run by the banking industry, run by the bankers. Where, and, and they're doing it in sections. The, the European currency, the euro, and, and the European constitution is one part of it. Now they're trying to do it in America with the North American Union. Right, and they want to create a new currency called the Amero, right? And uh, the whole the, the whole agenda is to create a one world government where everybody has an R F I D chip implanted in them. All money is to be um, in those chips, right? There'll be no more cash. And this is given me straight from Rockefeller himself. So this is what they want to accomplish. And all money will be in your chips. And so, any, so not, instead of having cash, any time you have money in your, in, your, in your ship, they can take out whatever they want to take out whenever they want to. If they say you owe us this much money in taxes, they just deduct it out of your ship digitally. Total control. Total control. And if you're like me or you, and you're protesting what they're doing, they can just turn off your ship.